Always had a thing for good-looking clothes. I spent a lot of money on wardrobe. <laughs> no, being champ, but it looked like one too. Now this suit, this suit really paid off for me. Yeah, looking sharp. What do you think? Huh? I got nothing? You're gonna give me nothing? Nothing? The Venice Film Festival is going on this month, and there is one film that has caught my eye. It's called The Featherweight, and it's set in 1964. It centers itself on the retired world featherweight boxing champion, Willie Pep, as he decides to head back into the ring due to mounting debt. <laughs> For actor James so Matteo, he says it's not only the role of a lifetime, but a prophecy fulfilled. And one day he just calls me and he's like, you know, hey, Jimmy boy, he said, daddy, uh, you got to look up this boxer named Willie Pep. Uh, I think you should play him. And I call him back. I'm like, dad, I'm, I'm busy. I'm trying to get this thing. I'm producing this. I'm trying to, I got this voiceover today. I got an audition later on. Like, I, I'm busy. He goes, just look him up. And I look him up. And first thing I do is print it out. And I put it on my desk, put a picture of him on my desk. And I was like, all right, I'll, I'll circle back around to him. And before I knew it, Steve Loft, the writer, had showed up at my house and he said, who's that? And I said, Willie Pep. And we just started researching him and making phone calls and just took off from there. But yeah, it, it, it truly started from my old school Italian father pushing me, uh, <laughs> saying this will change your career. And uh, he was right. Willie Pep is often considered one of the best boxers of all time. Featherweight focuses on the latter parts of his career after Pep's first retirement. After five years out of the ring, Pep finds himself going broke to an expensive lifestyle. With no recourse, he turns back to boxing and the life of fighting. Director Robert Kolodny explains that the movie has meaning and will leave the audience asking questions about identity. It's quite a brutalistic thing. You know, you're elevated to this grandiose platform on, on a world stage. And once your body gives out, you kind of, you can't do it anymore. And then who are you? You know, it leaves you asking these questions of identity that you might have to spend the rest of your life filling in. Willie Pep was a well-known gambler and even a more legendary ladies' man. In his life, Willie Pep was divorced six times. When it was all said and done, Pep had 229 wins and only 11 losses. Every time I wake up, shit feel the same. Got a million thoughts and they ringing on my brain. Sipping on my favorite liquor just to ease the pain. Cause I feel like I'm crazy and that's what need to change. Making plans to move and talk from state to state. Talking pounds and haze, medical high. Ray, look on my eyes. Stay, what more can I say? How dare a nigga tell me that this rap won't work?